All right, hey, Josh Attica Lumber. All right, here's the backdrop right here. 60 by 80, 20 feet tall. This is obviously gonna be for boat storage. Uh, you can see the guys here, they're knocking out the header here. We'll go in and check out this project. It's a little loud, so I'm standing back right now. But uh, again, 60 by 80, 20 feet tall. This is up in Ottawa County, Ohio, uh, not too far from the lake. Actually, it's uh, Lakeside, Ohio. But you can see this gentleman's got the privacy window, obviously a nine light entry door. You can see the color, how it's setting up here, gray side wall. And I believe, you know, I'm looking at this, I see some blue trim. So it looks like it's actually gonna be blue. And then a uh, blue roof as well. So let's take a look at it. Actually, the guys are coming down here. But let's walk into this thing right here. This is one of those ones you can put in your backyard for your everyday folks here. 60 by 80, 20 feet tall. Yeah, why not? But uh, you can see right here, uh, when you're spanning trusses like that, you can see what we use. We used, uh, obviously, a double header for that. And again, I know if you're talking about like Morton or uh, Cleary, I know they like to not those. Again, uh, it's up to you know design the engineering and how that works. But this customer decided to do three ply laminated columns. And if you've been following along in my previous videos, you know, uh, obviously there's different options. You probably see the concrete perma columns. Actually, these are four ply, excuse me, four ply. But look at the structural strength on these, okay? I'm gonna share this with you. Uh, the pressure points, these are four ply, two by six, okay? Obviously on a bigger building, you need to have something a little bit stronger. But see the pressure point there, pressure point right there, pressure point there, and then also a pressure point right there, hopefully you can see. So that gives the building, obviously keep the building from racks, keep it very, very straight. So these guys are moving out, as you can see. Just stand back and let you observe these guys. They do not mess around and so forth. They're a well oiled machine. And uh, this is actually day three, so I'm kind of give you some perspective on how they operate here. So they do not mess around. Quality crew. And uh, so 60 by 80. 20 feet tall, and uh, for more information, you can uh, obviously look us up on the internet at atticlumber.com, or you can always call us and talk to one of our reps. Attic Lumber since 1925.